Is that divine intervention? <laughs> your patience. Oh, this is a much better side. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up, we don't have all day. Okay. Okay. Uh, in ancient times, it was believed that there was a vein that went directly from the third finger of each hand to the heart. So traditionally, we wear our wedding rings on the third finger of the left hand, because that's the closest to the heart. Did anyone know that before? Yep. Very few of you. I think that's just in any case, rings have always been an outward sign that a couple had committed themselves to each other, and I ask that these rings that you exchange here today forever after be considered a confirmation, acceptance, and a daily reminder of the vows that you've shared. So, Mike, would you take the ring for Annie, please? Place it on the third finger of your left hand. and distractions, friends and food and family and things that can take you out of what this moment is really all about. I'm sure most couples remember how fleeting this moment really was on their wedding day. So I'd like you to just take a few moments now to look deeply into each other's eyes. Think of the happiness you're feeling in this place, this time. Let that feeling really register in your hearts and in your minds. Now think of yourself. 
themselves together 20 years from now. <laughs> Yikes, right? <laughs> what do you think you'll be doing? We all know that your vision of the future is not going to be identical, but it is always complementary. John Lennon once said, a dream we dream alone is just a dream, but a dream we dream together, that can be reality. And your new reality begins right now. By the power of your love and commitment, I now very happily pronounce you husband and wife, partners in life. You may now seal your bond. Wondrous the merge, and it seems to really apply. And I'd like to share that as well. Wondrous, wondrous the merge, wondrous the merge of soulmates, the surprises of recognition, wondrous the flowerings of renewal, wondrous the wings of the air clapping their happy approval. May you always share that magic carpet that upholsters your boundless bridge, and may you ever after sail out to the cosmos and wake all the you please welcome for the first time as a fully and truly married couple, Mike and Anna.